James Webb detected city-like lights four light years away. Are we alone? The James Webb Space Telescope has made a discovery so extraordinary that it has stunned both the scientific community and the general public. Using its unmatched sensitivity to infrared light, the telescope has detected what appear to be beams of light radiating from a distant world. Light that resembles the glow of a city skyline viewed from space. This mysterious source of illumination is coming from Proxima Centauri b, an exoplanet orbiting our closest neighboring star, just over four light years away. The implications of this finding are nothing short of groundbreaking. These lights, shining from the dark side of the planet, don't align with any known natural phenomena. Instead, they closely mimic artificial lighting, like the kind found in major urban areas here on Earth. This observation has reignited humanity's most ancient and exciting question. Are we alone in the universe? For decades, scientists have searched the cosmos for clues of life beyond Earth, scanning stars, analyzing atmospheres, and listening for signals. But rarely has an observation sparked so much hope and speculation as these mysterious city-like lights. The possibility that they could be evidence of an alien civilization has excited researchers worldwide. Could we finally be seeing the glow of a distant, intelligent society? The telescope's observations were made while focusing on Proxima Centauri b, a rocky exoplanet orbiting in the habitable zone of its red dwarf star. This means the planet can, under the right conditions, support liquid water, one of the key ingredients for life. But what caught astronomers off guard was the unusual bursts of brilliance that didn't correspond with solar flares reflections, or any known planetary phenomena. Instead, they resembled patterned artificial light emissions, the kind we associate with highly developed cities. NASA scientists and astronomers, including Dr. David Kipping of Columbia University, were astounded. Kipping described the planet as, uniquely complex, noting that it doesn't behave like other rocky worlds. Most planets absorb sunlight and re-emit it as infrared heat in predictable ways. But Proxima Centauri b's emissions were highly irregular, hinting at unusual surface or atmospheric behavior. Some researchers have even gone as far as suggesting the possibility of structured development, or large-scale artificial activity on the planet's surface. So, how did we see all this from so far away? The James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST, plays a crucial role in our exploration of distant worlds. Its ability to detect faint infrared radiation makes it the most powerful space observatory ever built. It can capture light from objects too distant and dim for previous telescopes, including the potential glow of artificial lighting on exoplanets during their night cycle, when the planet is not illuminated by its star. Unlike starlight, which is spread across a broad spectrum, artificial lighting tends to emit in narrower frequency bands. JWST is sensitive enough to detect such narrow-spectrum light, especially if it contrasts with the planet's natural thermal emissions. This ability allows scientists to distinguish natural planetary glow from possible technological signatures. The discovery also opens new doors in understanding Proxima Centauri b's environment. The planet is tidally locked to its star, meaning one side always faces the star while the other remains in constant darkness. This leads to extreme temperature variations, potentially scorching heat on one side and freezing cold on the other. If the planet has an atmosphere, it could help balance these extremes by distributing heat, possibly making it more hospitable. This is where the James Webb Telescope becomes even more valuable. Its instruments are ideal for measuring thermal emissions and detecting chemical compositions in planetary atmospheres. By analyzing how the planet traps and releases heat, Scientists can begin to infer whether it has an atmosphere, and if so, whether it contains key gases like carbon dioxide, methane, or water vapor. These gases are not just signs of weather, they're potential biosignatures, indicators that life might be shaping the planet's environment. Interestingly, the orbital cycle of Proxima Centauri b is about 11.2 Earth days, and JWST's own orbit is positioned in a way that allows scientists to track this cycle with remarkable precision. This synchronized observation window gives researchers regular opportunities to monitor changes in light, temperature, and chemical traces over time. If the planet does have an atmosphere, the next major goal is to detect more refined chemical markers, 
such as oxygen, ozone, or combinations of gases that are unlikely to exist without biological processes. On Earth, for instance, free oxygen is constantly replenished by plant life. If oxygen is detected on Proxima Centauri b, it would be a significant indicator that something, perhaps even life, is active on the surface. While JWST is well equipped for this type of exploration, it does face some limitations. It can effectively detect methane, carbon dioxide, and water vapor, but is less sensitive to free oxygen. To fill in these gaps, future observatories, both space-based and ground-based, are being developed with even more advanced instruments. One such telescope is the Extremely Large Telescope, ELT, currently under construction and expected to begin operations by 2027. The ELT will provide unprecedented resolution and the ability to conduct high-precision spectroscopy of exoplanet atmospheres. Together with JWST, these instruments will form a powerful duo in our quest to detect alien life. Meanwhile, scientists are already working on next-generation space telescopes designed to block out starlight, allowing them to better observe the faint reflected light of exoplanets. Techniques like the coronagraph and starshade are among the most promising. A coronagraph, installed inside a telescope, masks the brightness of a star, while a starshade, a flower-shaped spacecraft, flies thousands of kilometers ahead of the telescope to block starlight before it ever enters the lens. These innovations are being developed to achieve one goal, directly image planets like Earth orbiting distant stars. With these tools, we could one day see actual continents, cloud systems, or even vegetation signatures on alien worlds. But these advances aren't easy. Aligning a starshade across vast distances requires millimeter-level precision, and the harsh conditions of space present serious engineering challenges. Yet despite the obstacles, scientists remain determined. The potential reward, discovering life, intelligence, or even alien infrastructure, is too great to ignore. If artificial lights have truly been detected on Proxima Centauri b, it could be the first technological signature ever identified beyond Earth. And that would be a turning point in human history. It's possible that we're not just observing another planet, we're witnessing signs of a civilization, one that may have existed for thousands, maybe even millions of years. Could they be aware of us? Are we looking at them, while they look back? Of course, we must proceed cautiously. Extraordinary claims require extraordinary evidence. These observations still need further analysis, peer review, and verification across multiple wavelengths and observatories. But even so, the discovery has pushed the boundaries of what we believed was possible. This is just the beginning. The James Webb Space Telescope has given us our first real glimpse into the possibility of intelligent life on another world. With every observation, we move one step closer to answering one of the oldest and most profound questions humanity has ever asked. Are we alone in the universe? With future missions, better telescopes, and more refined technology, we may soon find ourselves standing at the edge of a new era, not just of space exploration, but of cosmic connection. The lights we saw on Proxima Centauri b might not just illuminate a planet. They may illuminate our future. Subscribe to Discovery at 2.0 to stay updated as this story unfolds. The universe is vast, mysterious, and full of surprises, and we're only just beginning to understand what's out there. Thank you for watching.